awkward flagpole. Yeah, I don't know where that came from. My cousin just did that all of a sudden when <laughs> we went out to go see uh, Les Mis a few weeks ago. I thought it was hilarious. I mean, we all know awkward turtle. Uh, if I can get my thumbs, I, I, I guess that's good enough. But yeah, all of a sudden just and it was hilarious. Um, so yeah, I'm wearing my Fulham jersey today. Um, playing Manchester United in the FA Cup. Hopefully they're able to get away with a win or at least a respectable loss. Um, yeah. Um, have you guys ever thought about how, if you think about it, the Netherlands really sounds like a terrible place to live? Like, Netherlands. If you go to uh, Merriam-Webster, they define nether as being situated down or below, and two, situated or believed to be situated beneath the Earth's surface. All right, synonyms, lower, inferior. It's like, why would you want to go live in a place in the, the inferior lands? Like, really, have you ever thought about that? It's really weird. Also, interesting thing in French is that the French name for the Netherlands is Peiba, and Peiba literally translates into land of nether, pay land ba of back. So, yeah, I thought that was really interesting. I noticed that um, at the Summer Olympics last time around, I'm like, whoa, this literally translates. Languages are interesting. So yeah, another week's gone by. I finally got my French class sorted out. Um, I wanted to just take a brush up on French. I've taken like seven years of it over my entire life. So I just want to take a brush up of the class. It'll fulfill my foreign language requirement. And I was in 101 and I'm like, I know all this stuff. So I talked to my teacher and I moved into 201. And it's really nice because now I only have one class on Monday, Wednesday, Friday and it's at 11 o'clock, so I'm loving my senior semester so far. Um, so I got another couple of basketball games today. Actually, in three hours, I'm going to be on my way over to the arena. Um, yeah, we got Savannah State today, and more than likely, the men's team is going to blow ours out of the gym. It's going to be really bad. It's going to be really bad. But you know what? I'm going to do my best to make it sound as great as possible. Um, you guys should definitely tune in today. Uh, 4 o'clock is when I go on air for the women's game. I'll be doing play by play. Color commentary for the men's game. Uh, yeah, we'll just try to make the team sound as good as possible. Um, and hopefully, at the end of the day, we're not saying we've lost now 22 consecutive uh, men's uh, 22 consecutive conference games. It's just not fun. Anyway, life update video. I'll see you guys next time around.